What else is in the news? Um, oh, goodness. I don't believe this story. Markle preparing bid to be America's first woman president. She's networking senior <laughs> Dems. She's going to try and become president. This half-wit actress. Uh, I think there's a few ahead of her, like uh, Kamala Harris. And all I can say is, if I were giving Miss Markle any advice, don't drive through that same tunnel in London that the princess drove through before the car crash. Uh, what else is in the news? Uh, Norway reports severe blood clot cases. I Ireland suggests a halt. Paris may face new lockdown as ICUs fill up. Europe confronts rebound as Vax hopes recede. German cases could revisit December peak. Brazil plunges at the deadliest chapter of epidemic COVID taking over. So they're having a, res a resurge. So if we're going to start eating outdoors, we're supposed to feel we're going to die tomorrow. What else is going on? Fauci the fraud, Dr. Faustus, who should have been put in prison for what he did to this country, says the U.S. could follow Italy's lockdown path if COVID measures are lifted too soon. That bum. He's the worst man in the history of epidemiology. He is not a scientist. Fauci is a liar. He's a vaccine peddler. And he's a complete and total danger to this country, in my opinion. Shot ban. AstraZeneca vaccine suspended in Germany over blood clot fears despite UK vow jab is safe. That's in the U.S. Sun today. Germany is the 14th country to suspend use of the AstraZeneca COVID vaccine due to blood clot fears. But Boris Johnson, oh, what a piece of work he is and what a disappointment he is. Boris Johnson says the jab is safe and says there's no proof it was the cause of fatal blood clots in people who had recently received it. 14 countries said it is. But Boris Johnson said it isn't. I guess he works with Fauci. How's the global warming thing coming? Epic storm has dumped 50 plus inches in Wyoming. Denver has the fourth <laughs> biggest snow ever. <laughs> Where's Elizabeth Warren, Bernie Sanders, and John Kerry, the czar of global warming today? Probably skiing in Aspen. So on that note, I'm going to have another sip of Costa coffee. Mm. Because I have a headache reading the news of the day. Thank you for listening to the Savage Nation podcast. Mm -hmm.